the best gift you can have in this earthly life is a man of God as your husband, women of God as your wife. So there cannot be a better choice than a woman of God and a man of God united for God, with God, what a marriage it is. Hallelujah. So that's why God smiles at them. I am so happy when God created Adam and Eve, the first marriage. No mother-in-law, no father-in-law, no sister-in-law. No fighting, no biryani, big piece, small piece. Because of that piece, they lost their piece. There is no such thing in Eden. God was everything. Father God, Son God, Holy Spirit God, angels. What a marriage it is. No comment. Boy doesn't look like this. The girl is not tall enough. No comment in Eden marriage. God was there. His blessing was there. His smiling was there. What do you need? God's blessing. Only with God's blessing you can bless the whole world. So God made that. Because God loves. Do you know? Do you know? God is a family God. Many of us, we think God is very big, very great, creator, wonderful. But they don't know God is a typical, wonderful family God. He likes a family. Why God created a man? Because he had a deep desire to have a family. He saw an elephant, the elephant had a family. Everything he created, they had a family. Trees had a family. Birds had a family. Suddenly God thought, everybody has a family. Why not I have a family like? Can you imagine God as a family God? Listen, God wanted a family. Can you imagine God had a desire for a family? So God said, let us create our own family. Elephant has family. Kutta has family. Cat has family. They have children. Mother, mother cat and baby cat, they look alike. They talk meow meow language. I cannot talk my language. So father said, let us create man and women. Exactly like us. We can talk to them. They can talk to us. They can resemble us. They can have children and take our name. They can show the world how I look like. That was God's dream for marriage. So he created man and women, of course, with a mud body. The body is mud, but breath is God. Some people live, some people marriage means two mud joining together. <laughs> This is a black mud, red mud, mixed together, became husband and wife. All they have is a mud relationship, <laughs> flesh relationship. That's not family. Man and women were created from the mud, mud in dust. There is a dust family, there is a divine family. I want to make it very clear. Let me ask you, do you live a dust life or divine life? That shows who you are. He took the dust and he made a statue. And he gave them, made them a man. Then he breathed. You know why? Outside you are dust. Inside my life, my life, my breath is in you. So you become a combination of dust and divine. That's a family life, beloved. Everything, body, desire, yes. Physical uh, eating, meeting, dating, yes. Having children, yes. Having a nice car, yes. Having a nice uh, children, yes. But the best thing marriage is, God's life is in me.
everybody please say it god is a family god he didn't form a church first he formed a family first he didn't make a factory first he formed a man and woman first family first is god's order i have seen in my life i am in the ministry i have seen many pastors many leaders many high class people when i see them i always notice are they successful in family life i have leaders around me i have hundreds of leaders thousands of pastors come to me i watch them is he a true husband is he giving first place to the family life if i see people are not giving number one place to the family i don't respect them i don't even join them if you fail in a family life everything you do will not succeed i am ministering for 50 years i am a man of god if my wife is crying in the room i cannot go and preach i know it i cannot continue i am a servant of god first thing your success in family life then only factory will be successful work will be successful your children will be blessed your future will be blessed health will come to the family first place family why god gave first place to the family that's a model that's a model sometimes you know when i read the bible god will speak to me sometimes i read sometimes god speaks when god speaks to me if my wife comes suddenly to my room i have two choice now i am meditating god is speaking please go or jesus sorry my wife is coming first i will talk to her then i will talk to her i understood when i say jesus sorry my wife is coming he smiles he smiles after i talk to her and send her he talks much more i understood ah god himself likes me to give priority to the family did you get me did you get me did you get me so please understand beloved family is god's heart god's dream god's ambition god's priority check it, check your life and give the priority and i want to give quickly i want to tell you another thing because family is most important to god devil's number one hatred is against the family you understand because god made family first the devil say okay attack the family first that's devil strategy that's why when god created adam and eve they had honeymoon they were happy devil could not wait he didn't even wait up to the first child he didn't wait he is cunning than more than anybody else he first went to touch the family to hit the family to separate the family 
to take the family in his hand devil hates because god loves obvious he hates god so he god hates his devil hates his family so he came you know the whole story family broke both of them were sent out only two dust went divine cut off so no god without god husband and wife trying to live it's like without engine car wants to run <laughs> when god man women together is a powerful engine car when god was created cut off only i am made for you you are made for me we are a good match only two connection when they come engine is off after that to run a family you have to push how long you can push how long you can push engine no engine no how can you push the family without god no one can live as a good husband or a good wife or good parents or good children so the if you see the whole family bible family was attacked attack attack the family holiness the family purity the family joy the family health the family wealth was heavily attack 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 thank you jesus yeshu aya jesus came the hindi song says sabse pyara yeshu aya mera jeevan badal gaya my jesus came my wife like che and when jesus came he had an agenda i had to go to galilee i had to go here i have to raise the dead i have to heal the sick i have to heal many lepers i had to preach a long sermon i have within 3 years i have full schedule so god did everything you know what father and jesus said father said my son before going anywhere before showing you a miracle anywhere fast miracle do it in your family marriage fast miracle if i was jesus i would have asked dear father father first i raised the lazarus from dead that will shake the whole world then i will go to the wedding wedding but changing water into wine nobody will see it because if you see the marriage they call the bridegroom they appreciated him bridegroom acha thraksharaks good uh, wine you kept it so long very good bride said yeah it's god's favor so nobody knows only the disciple know it and the servants know it so i would have said lord give me a big miracle first let me prove who i am but god said no my first priority is family and the devil's priority attack hit list was family so first i will go to the family marriage that is jesus did you understand the story i want to tell all of you god wants to do miracle 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 fast in your family once when he does miracle in your family all the other miracles are chota miracle any miracle anna no money don't worry no five paisa don't worry children are sick don't worry if husband wife 
together hold the hand children will live they will be healed they are the generator as the family goes so goes everything please give priority give priority in that marriage i want to finish 5 10 minutes or half an hour or maximum one hour two hours not more than 3 hours maybe 4 hours <laughs> it's my chance to get you you know what happened you have to understand family with a engine family without engine can i put it in short word natural family supernatural family hallelujah natural family you have to push if i say love your husband uh, uh, obey your husband uh, i have to obey i have to obey i have to obey but that fellow is drinking how to obey that fellow is running after another girl how to obey she will cry husband will say she is such a fighting woman how to love please understand family life is must be a miracle family life i love my wife honestly it's not my natural love god's love that miracle love that supernatural miracle love that fills me then i will love my wife no matter what she does i may shout but still love is stable because it's god's love it's not man and woman they love and they obey god say you don't love i love your wife living in your body and jesus says don't worry i am inside you i will make you to obey your husband so the whole family become god's love god's holiness god's purity that's the purpose of god's love i tell you honestly i have seen million families they will teach on family how to have successful family 25 points and they cannot even survive 25 days divorce it's not your love it's not your trying it's god in your family fills you with his breath with his love with his purity with that you live your super natural family and life you can never live your pure life unless christ lives in you and helps you to live a pure life natural life everybody say it. natural love natural life. life natural marriage natural marriage natural family natural family after some time after some time wine will run out wine will run out wine will run out wine will run out joy will run out joy will run out unity will run out unity will run out blessings will run out blessings will run out love will run out love will run out but supernatural family when natural love runs out i will draw out god's love you understand listen me and my wife naturally i try to obey i am i, I love i couldn't at that time jesus no wine in me no wine no love no attraction jesus i tried everything dried at that time 
God will say, draw out Sam and give. God's love is so wonderful. God's love is so wonderful. God's love is so wonderful. So wonderful love. Listen, Jesus, I can't live holy. I need another lady. I need another man. I tried. Jesus will say, don't worry. Draw out some and give. God's love is so wonderful. God's love is so wonderful. God's love is so wonderful. Oh, wonderful love. Mary ran. No one, no one, no one. Natural family will focus only what is missing. Understand. My wife has thousand godly character. Only one nature I don't like. Thousand wonderful one thing I don't like about my wife, the devil will come. I, uh, your wife has that weakness. Uh, that he will make it very big. You will be only looking at what is missing, what is lacking in your husband or in your wife. You will not see, hey, there are hundred good things about him. Thank you, Lord. My husband is a saved man. Thank you, Lord. He is such a sweet husband. Thank you, Lord. He is a generous giver. Thank you, Lord. He is a Bible scholar. No. He is an angry guy. He is an angry guy. He is an angry guy. The devil will give the focus light and what is missing in your husband or wife and a small pebble, he will make it like a mountain. That is natural family. That is natural family. No wine, no beauty, no opener, no patience, nonsense. Look at how many good things God has put in your partner. Start thanking. How is it possible, Anna? Only when you fill your heart with Christ's love. Mary said, no one. Supernatural family will not see what is lacking. Supernatural family will see the supplier is living in the family. He will fill all our needs according to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus. Every lack Every lack, if my wife is uh, lacking this, I am lacking this. In the family, this is a lack. Children, this is a lack. Blessing lack. Any lack. The Bible says, my God shall supply, supply all your need. All your need. All your needs. According to the rich, his riches in glory. Through Christ Jesus. Amen. Everybody say it now. Every need in my family. Every need in my family. What do what I lack in my family? What I lack in my family. My God. My God. Shall supply. Shall supply. All. All. My need. My need. According to his riches. According to his riches. You know, according to his riches. Is different 
from out of his riches. How many of you can know it? Out of his riches means, out of his riches, my worker, my worker in the garden has a marriage. He says, I give some money for the marriage. I am a millionaire. I give him 10,000 rupees. Out of my riches, out, I gave 10. Even if I give 1 lakh, out of my riches I give him. Imagine I have a son. I conduct his marriage. Will I conduct the marriage out of my riches or according to my riches? According to my riches. Millennia do the best marriage. I am rich according to my standard conduct. My God shall my God supply. Shall supply. My God. My God shall supply. Shall supply all your need. All your need. My God. My God shall supply. Shall supply all your need. All your need. According. According to His riches. To His riches in glory. In glory through Christ Jesus. Through Christ Jesus. Some people will say, "In glory, then, eh? <laughs> when you go to heaven, all your need in heaven. What need you have?" Listen, not only that, when supernatural family come, Christ family, God inside family will never focus on what is missing, what is already kissing you from Christ. Not missing, not what is your lack. The miracle family will look at the supply and draw it. Now, the natural family will look at the lack and cry. Thank God, Jesus went to the marriage first. Amen. To turn your attention from what is missing to what is supplied. Yes. Another thing, the dining man, the dinner in charge man drank it. He said, hey, what is this? Best wine. Best wine. I think he would have never in his life drank such a sweet wine. It is super <laughs> nice. You go to America, America juice, Europe juice. Even my wife's German juice cannot be a match to my heavenly father's juice. Totally high class standard. Not five star, not seven star. Million star standard. That is supernatural. Christ honored. Christ inside. Family. Hallelujah. What did he do? Everybody will give the best. After some time, less taste inferior. Meaning, natural family, first six months, super. After six years, pauper. <laughs> natural family, as the days goes by, taste goes, excitement goes, as my wife said, routine, routine, same bed day, no attraction. But supernatural family, every day, higher, higher, higher. We are climbing higher, higher. We are climbing higher, higher. We are climbing higher, higher. Soldiers of the cross. I want to encourage everybody here, believe God for the best marriage life. Thank you for that smiling. Believe God. Naturally, not possible. Supernaturally, very much possible. That's why Jesus came. That family was a Catholic church, a Catholic marriage. Because 
that family is related to Mary, not to Jesus. God loves Catholics so much, he wants to do miracle first in that family. Uh, in my ministry, I have seen very easy to minister and bless people if the Catholics open their heart, they are fully for God. No dancing, no acting. They believe in miracle power. Then the Protestant. So Jesus said, okay, let me first select Mary's church. <laughs> and she did, he did a miracle. Please understand, your family life must go higher. More healthy, more wealthy, more tasty, more loving. Some people blink. You know. There is a saying in Tamil, Inji tinit chan korangu. And the marina inna da solatam. Na ungala solalana. So nala na or takapan solala. Listen, every day your life will go higher. Honestly, I tell you, husband and wife love. They will love in the 20s, very high level. But when Christ takes the family, when both of them lose their tooth, they become Mahatma Gandhi. That is the highest love they will have. Really? I am married to my wife how many years? 14 and a half years. I forget. Women never forget. 14 and a half years. I know her weakness more now than before. She knows my weakness than before. But God knows I love her more than ever before. Because it is wine from heaven. More sweeter. Best wine. Not inferior wine. How is it possible, Anna? It's not possible naturally. It is God's miracle working in your life. That's it. Then whatever he says, you will do it. Can I tell you? I pray more and hear God more when me and my wife have some problem. Sometimes if we don't have fighting, I am not that spiritual. Honestly. I pray many hours before preaching. But when me and my wife have a problem, I pray all the time. You know why? Only God can tell you how to solve that problem. How to change that wife's Different wavelength brain. <laughs> Wife have different dictionary from men. So the only miracle I have understood, at that time I pray in tongues more. Then God will give you a pa. Her brain is very different from your brain. Don't attempt. Sometimes when I try to go and make her more happy, that's the time, big fighting. So I understood, oh, it's a miracle solution. Huh? It's not my book reading solution. Huh? Don't fed up. Don't fed up. Get into the Holy Spirit. Whatever he says, do it. Best days are ahead. And God manifested his Glory. Family is the place where devil doesn't manifest, God manifests. Marriage is not two people living together. It is one person living in two people and running a family life. Simple, simple. Please stand up.
father god is here jesus christ is here you and i cannot see it but he is spirit the angels are here i want to tell you beloved all your family whatever is lacking in your family whatever is missing in your children is it financial lack is there a health issue is there a children blessing is there a peace missing no joy no peace between husband and wife i want you to know christ jesus is inside your family Amen. to supply all your lacks to supply all your need according to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus i tell you as a man of god every day your family will have more anointing more presence of god more family more added blessing more healing more health more love more peace more unity Amen. that is god's dream for you that is god's passion for you your family need not go down 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 it can go higher 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 that's why jesus came in your family God wants to show his glory through husband and wife. He wants to show his glory, his power through your children. He wants to show his his power in everything you do. He will fight your battles. You need not fight the enemy that's coming against your families. as a man of god i declare though your beginning was small the end shall be much greater as a man of god i prophesy to you your later days shall be more glorious than all your former days people will say what a family every natural family is becoming cold how your family is more loving more blessed how 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 you will be a testimony your family will be a testimony to the natural people only thing you understand look at jesus not one another you are a three fold card jesus husband wife three fold card that cannot be broken your family is built on jesus christ and his word of god no storm no rain no waves can break your family because you are built on Jesus you will stand all the test and trial and you will be a victorious testimony for God's glory every family here every family even the families that listen our voice we pray now me and my wife come on me and my wife alex suda we enjoy the miracle family life so we bless you now you expect a miracle you expect a miracle you expect a miracle ore atara bara sentere ra dora prevala sandere vere che desha moro dora prevela desha atara bantara vala yendre vesheri abrogoro samba like in that time in the garden of eden eve listened to the serpent 
They allowed the serpent to come in. They allowed the devil to come in. They started believing the lies of the devil. Right now, you just say, no, devil. I will no more listen to your lies. Today, I have heard the truth. Today, I have heard the truth. Today, I have heard the plan of God for my marriage. No matter how many years you are married, no matter what happened, no matter what, today you say enough, enough. Sorry, Lord. I allowed the serpent to come in. I allowed the devil's voice to be heard in my marriage. Forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. I listened. I listened. I went that way. I obeyed. I spoke the words the devil wanted me to speak. Forgive me. Forgive me. Forgive me. Forgive me. Forgive me. Cleanse me. Cleanse me. Cleanse me. Jesus, and today, right now, I want to come back to the marriage that you have planned. I want to come back to God's design for marriage, God's plan for marriage, God's glorious plan for marriage. Forgive me, Lord. I tried to do it in my way. I got so frustrated. Today I understood. Only I have to say no to the devil. Resist the devil. He will flee from me. Only I have to say, Jesus, you take control. You take control. Jesus, just take control. Just take control. Lord Jesus, just tell him. Just tell him. Lord Jesus, I resist the devil. Sorry. Sorry for listening more to the devil than I listen to you. Now I resist him. Now I say no, devil. Now I say yes to Jesus. Lord Jesus, come and take control. Just tell him. Just talk to him. Talk to him. Come and take control. Come and take control. I understood in my own strength, impossible, impossible, impossible. In my strength, impossible. In my wisdom, impossible. Holy Ghost, come. Jesus, come. Jesus, come and take control. Come and take control. Just invite him. Invite him. Invite him. Oh, Jesus is your wisdom. He became your wisdom, became your salvation. He became your life. He became your holiness. He became your sanctification. Everything he became. That's what Paul says. Oh, years of devil's torture are falling off of you right now. I can see it. It's like flowing away from you. Amen. You can feel you are becoming lighter. You can feel the weight is going. The heavy weight is going from you. Light is coming inside of you. Even inside of your mind. It's like you're light. My, a light is coming, it's becoming clearer, it's becoming, the confusions are going, the pains are going oh Holy Spirit take control take control, we Amen. rebuke the works of the devil yes. in every marriage here in yes. every family here we rebuke it in the name yes. of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Holy Spirit take control, Holy Spirit take control Lord where the children were hurt by seeing the parents misunderstandings the parents fightings the parents disunity oh the parents ah, even just a hypocrite life lord where the children were hurt let the healing happen let the healing happen between the generations lord let the children be healed so that the children can have boldness to step into marriage let there be healing 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 holy spirit take control holy spirit take control Holy Spirit, right now, every sickness, every disease. Oh, because of so much tension and torture in your life. Oh, your system was about to break down. So many areas, your body is just giving up, just giving in. Because the mind is never at peace. Right now we speak peace, be still to your mind. Peace, be still to your body. Peace, be still to your soul. Peace, be still to every cell of your body. To every cell of your body, yeah. every cell of your body, yeah. every cell of your body, we command health, we command healing. Yes, Holy Ghost, take control. The peace and the rest of Jesus, take upon me my yoke. Learn from me, learn from me, take my yoke upon me. Oh, I'm humble, I'm meek, I'm humble of heart. Holy Ghost. Oh, Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost, just take control. Take control. Pains go. Sicknesses go. Yeah. Oh, pains go. Yeah. All these imbalances go. go. Right now, balance is coming into your mind, yeah. into your spirit, into your body. Thank right you. now, the peace of God yeah. is just taking up a hand in your entire system. You. Such a peace is Thank coming. You. Such a peace, the peace that surpasses understanding. You couldn't feel peace for years. You couldn't really sleep well for years. Oh, you will feel peace. You will feel just the peace. Even in your stomach, you will feel peace. You always felt like there's a knot in your stomach. You couldn't eat. There was always such a tension in your stomach. 
now your stomach feels such a release right now you can feel it there's such a release there's such a peace in your stomach it's like the muscles were all knots all like knots all bound all hardened now they're just relaxing the muscles are just relaxing just relaxing the peace of god is flooding your entire system flooding your entire system holy spirit take control holy spirit take control mm, headaches so much headaches again and again morning you can manage in the night the headache is too much too much too much i rebuke this tension i rebuke this tension i rebuke this tension by the blood of jesus i command all the spondylitis to go i command the nerves to be totally free and open nerve channel in the spine completely free and open rearrangement in the name of jesus every pain go every pain go every muscle tension go the peace of god the perfect peace of god rule and reign in every heart mind soul spirit in every body in every family lord the peace of god lord all my brothers sisters let them see the situations with your eyes on the foundation of your word lord so many <coughs> misunderstandings even among the extended family among the children with everybody so many things just because the foundation is not a word of god the holy spirit is telling you look at the problems you have and ask my solutions study my word find out what what do i say what do i say about the situation not what society says what people say what experiences what the, what does my word say study it study it and i will give you the solution I will bring peace into the whole big extended family. I will bring the love of God into the extended family. Father, we bless all these dear ones. We cover them under the mighty power of the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord, let the angels of God go with them. Go to their places, even go ahead of them. Go to their homes. Let the miracles happen, Lord, because they came here today to honor a godly marriage, to honor this wedding. of two people who decided to serve you to dedicate their lives to you lord because they came to honor this decision let there be a profit reward let there be an honor in their lives also lord let there be a blessing for each and every family because they came here and they sought you i bless each and every one present in jesus name amen every family here let there be miracle 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 in every area where you have a need may the lord supply all your needs according to his riches in glory let your family become a wonder and miracle to the natural people let the people come to you and say we all are in need every family is collapsing how come you are going higher higher more loving more blessed let it be your testimony may the lord increase everything in your life may god manifest reveal his glory his power his healing his love through husband and wife through your children through every family not devil reveals his glory but jesus christ reveals his glory through you in jesus name